Hello everybody, I'm Ricky Smith. Welcome to Faith on Friday. When is the last time you were pampered, spoiled, or babied? If you can't remember, it's been way too long. Are you hoping for someone to show up and sweep you off your feet to show you how special and important you really are? Why wait? Caring for yourself actually gives you everything you need to care for others. The Greek word philautia, loosely translated, means love of self or self-love not the creepy narcissistic kind, but that balanced positive kind of love. You see, the more that you care for and love yourself, it makes you capable of showing love and caring for others. Taking some time out for self-care can actually improve your immunity, increase positive thinking, and make you less susceptible to things like stress, depression, and anxiety. But people who neglect themselves and their own needs find themselves at a much higher risk for deep levels of unhappiness, for isolation, for low self-esteem, and for feelings of resentment. So what could self-care look like for you? Get quiet, read a book, meditate, or pray. Take yourself out on a date or treat yourself to a spa day. Keep a journal of your daily wins. Spend time with people of peace, not folks who drain you emotionally, mentally, or spiritually. It's important to know who you are and what your needs are. And the best way to do that is to spend some quality time taking care of yourself. Like L'Oreal said, you're worth it. Thank you everybody for watching and thank you so much for sharing the videos. Don't forget, subscribe to our YouTube channel and give us a thumbs up. My name is Ricky Smith and I'll see you next Friday.